is number one. May I ask you a question? <laughs> oh my god, bro. This is like being in the worst court case ever. <laughs> I feel like I'm back at the Brendan trial. <laughs> All like, right, I will say my co- Are you guys still harassing him on the internet? <laughs> no, 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 That's what I'm... Judge, judge may, I, may I have a pose? Please, co- please. Is number one. Oh, so they're still talking about this. I mean, I bet you that's one of the reasons why Theo Vaughn also distanced himself and stopped doing a podcast with Brendan Job. Him going after Bobby Lee. Hilarious way to bring it up, too. <laughs> feel like I'm in court again. Are you still harassing Brendan on the internet? Where's the 300 pages? Oh, my God. Uh, the 300 pages thing was so hilarious because, well, I got mentioned in that somehow because he tried saying, Brendan Schaub did try saying that uh, there was federal investigators looking into me or something, which was weird. And then he said he had 300 pages of evidence against Bobby Lee. And, of course, he didn't have any of that. It was a ridiculous thing to state and say. And when he went to go show evidence, he showed a piece of paper, uh, one like a paragraph, and one of the things in it said Robert Lee. And I don't think Bobby Lee's name is Robert. I think his real name is just Bobby. <laughs> like, I know... People who are called Bobby are actually named Robert, but I don't think Bobby Lee was named Robert. So I I don't know. Pretty hilarious that CEO would go on there and bring it up. And I mean, think about what Brendan Schaub tried to do to Bobby Lee. The dude, him and Callan called him and threatened him by using Joe Rogan's name. And uh, let me assure you, they've done that plenty of times. Maybe not to other comedians, but, hey, I'm trying to get into this restaurant. Oh, this is a waiting list. Oh, yeah, I know Joe Rogan. Uh, We'll destroy you, so let me in. I bet you it's been done dozens of times by Shab and Callan. And, I mean, Bobby Lee had to brought it up on H3H3. Then Shab went on, embarrassed himself. On their podcast, Tiger Belly, trying to explain himself, but he couldn't because there's really nothing to explain. Just pathetic. But I love the fact that they're still talking about it. Let me know your thoughts in the comments.